Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel and if you're thinking about starting your online business with minimal cost, today's video is perfect for you because I'll be walking you through how to dropship from Taobao to Shopee. So whether you're new to dropshipping or already have an e-commerce store, this tutorial will show you how to take advantage of Taobao's huge product selection and sell on Shopee. So let's dive right in. So as you can see here, you just need to go to this website, which is the Taobao. So here, you will just need to tap on that one. And then after that one is, you also need to go to your Shopee Seller Center. So you just need to wait for a while because this will take a minute. So you need to be patient for this one. So as you can see here, um, um, the language is not english but we can find a way for that one so here is a massive chinese online marketplace so here you can notice that the site is in chinese but don't worry because you can either use the google chrome's browser's built-in translation tool or you can browse with the taobao mobile app that has language settings so as you can see here there, there is a lot of product that you can see here so here to search for products you can type in the search bar using keywords or even upload an image to find a specific item so here search for trending or in-demand products on shopee and then then look for them on the taobao so you will all want to look for suppliers with good ratings reviews and reasonable pricing so take note of the items price shipping cost and processing time so as you can see here so you need to log in again to your account so after you log into your account you just need to enter your account name or your phone number and then your login password or you can either log in through your um, phone number by verification or the code verification and then after that one you just need to tap on that login button which is this one or you can also sign up for free and then you'll be directed here wherein you can create your account through your phone number so here you just need to fill in on this field so as you can see here so this will take you for a while and then here i am now successfully registered so my account here so here, I can also see here my Taobao account names, which is very important because this will be your account name. And then after that one, so right after you are done um, registered, so you will be directed um, here. You can see here a on this part, you will see different features of this website and it's up to you depending on you on how you will use this website. But on this tutorial, we are focusing on drop shipping through Shopee and the Taobao. So here, you just need to go here to the product category. So the, here, guys, they have a lot of categories that you can choose here. So as you can see here, this is a Chinese again. You just need to change or translate this into English. So as you can see here, it is now readable if you cannot understand Chinese language. So now, you will choose your category here. So depending on you, what product will you be used for drop shipping? As you can see here, for example, that one is I am going to be focusing on the bags. So here, I will just look for an example for my drop shipping. So make sure guys that the product that will be you will be using, um, it will always be a good idea to talk to the supplier on Taobao to make sure they support dropshipping. Um, this will help you avoid any complications down the road. So here, you can use the messaging feature to ask the supplier if they can ship directly to your customers. And then you can confirm the shipping cost because many Taobao suppliers are familiar with dropshipping but it's always best to clarify. So as you can see here, um, here, um, this bag, they had a lot of variations and color. So what will you do here is you need to go to um, to see the available um, colors. And then here, you can also see here um, what type of bag you will be drop dropshipping. Um, the color, you can also sort by here. And 
then check the price and then as you can see here it they have a buy it now button and then the add to cart button so the next thing that you need to do here is um for example guys you are done filling up on the shopee seller account so you will be now adding your product so as you can see here it's important to view and double check the reviews of the product that you will be using because that is a very important part so always check the supplier's rating and reviews before choosing a product and then make sure to calculate your pricing carefully so you can stay competitive and still make a profit so stay updated with shopee's trend and promotions and adjust your products offering accordingly so here as you can see here this image i will now go to my shopee seller center wherein i will now log into my account so right after that one is we are now on this part we're in here is my shop information you will be signing and filling in on this part so it's important to know that you need to have your um, legit store wherein they will be asking your um, taxes the name of your store so this information is very important guys so after that one is you will be able to see here the certificate of registration so you need to complete on this step in order for you to add a product so after you complete any step we will be moving forward to the next step so here so on this part now that you've found a product to sell it's time to list in on shopee so here click add new product in your seller center and then you will be adding image here so it's very important to add the image of the product and then you will need to fill in the key information such as the product name the description the category and the price okay note that guys that use the images and product descriptions from your taobao listing but make sure to localize it for your shopee audience if needed guys tweak the description to better fit the language and tone of your market and then for pricing always remember to factor in your profit margin you will need to calculate the total cost of the item including shipping fee from the taobao and set competitive price on shopee then after that one is under the shipping section set your shipping options you can offer free shipping to attract more customers but make sure you build that cost into your price and then once you start getting orders on shopee guys it's time to fulfill them using your taobao supplier so you will need to um, purchase the item from your Taobao supplier using the customer's address as the shipping destination. To do this, you need to enter the customer's shipping information directly in the Taobao. So, after that one, you are now completed. That's how you use dropshipping using Taobao to Shopee. Thank you for watching and goodbye.